Hello, this is Yanis Varoufakis with uh, a message of support and solidarity for my friends at the Institute for Palestinian Studies. As I utter these words, Palestine, Gaza in particular, is uh, being bombarded to smithereens. This is not the time to study the Palestinian issue. This is a time to defend the existence, the very existence of Palestinians, so that uh, the study of the people of Palestine does not become the equivalent of the study of Etruscans or other peoples that have disappeared from the face of the planet. These are difficult days for all of us who care about not just the Palestinians, but the Jews, uh, the Armenians in Nagorno-Karabakh, People who are not fashionable victims, because this is where we are today. The West, which is culturally so dominant, uh, has distinguished between fashionable and unfashionable victims. So if you are today a Ukrainian that is being bombed and resists uh, violently, then you're celebrated. But if you are a Yemeni or a Palestinian, you are uh, either bathed in its significance, or uh, bombed even further. My message to those who concentrate on Hamas now is really very simple. Imagine the terror in Tel Aviv and in Washington if Hamas, every single Hamas fighter, were to surrender. Just give up. Say, we were wrong. We're not going to do this anymore. What would they do? The answer is West Bank. Just look at what has been going on in the West Bank, where Hamas is not particularly active and certainly not dominant. Ethnic cleansing galore. The eradication of any possibility of the two-state solution. This is what should concentrate our minds, and this is what we should try to uh, stress and emphasize, uh, because we are in the West, in the world at large, uh, we are experiencing and we are part of a war of propaganda, the purpose of which is to justify fully the state of apartheid, ethnic cleansing, and the annihilation of the people of Palestine. Let's keep fighting.